Hello, I'm Santo and in this video I will take you through how to start a tomato business. Tomato is not a new term to you. It is used in majority of households, usually in meals, thus making it have the widest market. You see we have a tomato plant, it's being harvested, then it's taken to the market for sale. Then in the market, the farmer or the broker, they make profits, they make money. So let's look at the requirement for starting this business. First, you need a place for a location which is easily accessible. To shelter the tomatoes and other equipment, then you can decide to rent a room or make a shed. That's upon you to decide. Now, number two, you need a method of storage. You can use a refrigerator if you have, or a cheaper method just to preserve the tomatoes fresh also tomatoes are perishable you can do so to prevent losses and preserve the tomatoes from going bad then when it comes to sourcing of tomatoes if the place where you can find tomatoes we have the local farmers you can buy from them or from the large-scale farmers in greenhouses alternatively you can choose to grow them yourself in your farm you can also do mapping to identify the areas of high production, monitor prices of tomatoes in various areas, compare the market prices in various areas, also ensure that you buy cheap in a high production area and sell more in a high demanding area or area which has a scarcity of tomatoes so as to make profit. In terms of transportation, moving from the source of purchase where you purchase them to your business, if in bulk you can use a lorry or a truck or you can use a motorbike or small car for short distances if they are not much. When it comes to selling, stock marketing, there is a wide market for tomatoes in your business by your customers. Also, high demand in high demand and wide market in hotels, households, schools, supermarkets, the list is endless. Many people need tomatoes in their meals. And I think the farmers can't can't meet the supply, can't meet that demand. Tomato business pays off well. In this video, we focused on it as a business, and I'll make a future video on it as a farming practice. We are going to talk on it when it's on the farm and compare which one has the highest profit. Otherwise, thanks for watching. You can also watch other videos to learn more on various businesses in this channel. You can like, subscribe, share, not to miss out whenever we release any content. Bye-bye.